a combined weight of 501 pounds, the Raw Tag Team Champions, Solo Sokoa and Jimmy Uso, the Bloodline. Gentlemen, this has all the makings of an all-time classic match, and I fully expect it to deliver on that promise. Shawn Michaels has arrived. And their opponents, first from San Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 227 pounds, the heartbreaking Shawn Michaels! You are looking at maybe the very best sports entertainer in the world today. Michaels recently said that HBK is a doormat for nobody. He's not here to be a stepping stone for others. Plenty of superstars want their shot at HBK. They see beating him as a chance to prove they're the best around. Well, too bad for them. Shawn Michaels has made a career out of picking big fights and winning them. Whoa, Cena is taking it all the way back to his debut. And from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 249 pounds, John Cena! Some call this Cena's biggest failure. His very career was in jeopardy before it even started. I seriously doubt this is a moment Cena wants to revisit. These teams are ready to test each other in this tag team matchup. Ready for battle, as it'll be Solo Sokoa and Jimmy Uso. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Shawn Michaels and John Cena. And there is a lot of animosity growing between these teams. I expect all four competitors to throw caution to the wind. Thunderous Club comes down very effective. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. And off the tag is Jimmy Uso. Oh, caught by the back elbow. Oh. Backbreaker. He's in off the tag. Kick to the gut. Oh, God, that hurt. In off the tag. Steer clear. Bears line. Boom, what a punch. Up and down. What a gourd buster. Up on their shoulders. Down in a hurry. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Here it comes. Stay away from the worm. The to keep. Oh, look, able to free the arm and roll out. Great escape. Big back body 
drop. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And the man many consider the greatest of all time playing to the crowd. Back suplex. The arm getting pummeled. Reaches his partner for the tag. Dominating shoulder tackle. Elbow drop. The piercing. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And up the tag is Shawn Michaels. Across the top rope. Looking for the suplex all the way up. Look at this power. Oh no. Escapes and a chop block takes him down. Oh, cross body wipes them out. Goes into the pin. Two. He's determined to keep this matchup going. The car hits the spinning solo. Off into the pin. Yeah. Launched out of the corner. Ready to take flight. Headbutt to the heart. And off the tag. Yes, tag. the vibration of that one from all the way over here. That attack certainly put Jimmy's toughness to the test. Foul driver on its way. Oh, oh man. Spiked him. And that looked like a terrible landing. That might have caused some serious issues. We'll have to see what happens. Drops out with a neck breaker. Jarring impact. Tag made, fresh man in. Larry. Ah, uh, takedown, and now punches rights. Oh man, nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. Oof. Shawn Michaels in off the tag. Just me. of that on Sokoa's face now. Just like that! Uh-oh. Suicide dive to the outside. Cole does it better. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Elbow drop. Piercing. Bang! He's getting put down to the defensive. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Paul? From the top, through the air, and connects. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Jimmy saves himself. Flying 
forearm. This could do it! He keeps his team in the match. The springboard attack fails to land. Uh-oh! Just a desperate attack, breaking at the eye. left in these superstars' bodies. Yeah, the tank is being emptied tonight. One. Targeting the throat there. A big kick to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Oh, just gouging the face. Face gouge. Oh. Disrupt that attack. Close line. Just pounding it away. Enough already. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Cranking the head. He's tagging out. Big boots. And there's the cover. Out. What a match. Up in with a protoplex. Jimmy with a cause for alarm. And there's the save. Let's keep fighting. Oh. Cena gets intercepted. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Jimmy Uso with a well-timed shot. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And Jimmy still dishing out a very impactful attack. Cena came looking for a fight tonight, and boy, did he get one. Someone hold the roof down, because I think it's coming off the hinges. Uso. Jimmy Uso splash. Will Jimmy seal this up? Tag switching it up. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Rearing. Uh-oh. Saw that one coming. Took advantage. Setting up for something here. Oh, man. Right to the esophagus. Shawn Michaels tags in. Winning heel kick. And that move has HBK looking a little wobbly. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Knife edge chop. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Look at it in here! This could be it! No, stops the count at two. The fact that these superstars can still be moving at this point is beyond the realm of reality. Well-placed elbow to break up the maneuver. The WWE faithful communicating in no uncertain terms. It is electric in here. off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Uh-oh. Incredible reversal. Play it possum. Whoa. Play it possum. Three, no. He refuses to stay down. Pure instinct. What a suplex. Tagging his partner in now. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Oh, smash. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. Kicks out. He still has life. He just won't give up. Is this 
necessary. Ripping at the eyes. Ooh, elbow strike. Again, a tag is made. Here comes the double team. What do they have planned here? Oh, goodness! Make a wish. Impressive reversal from Michaels. He's been placed in the corner now. Tag. Uh-oh, here it comes. Inverted Alabama slam. Uh, stop right to the gut. Look at Cena now. We know what he has in mind. Up with a protoplex. That could put Solo down for good. And my word, this has been a match for the ages. This has been a monumental affair. Sokoa, the spinning solo by Sokoa. Uh-oh, winding up. Samoan spike. That's wanted for Sokoa before. Set him up for the rush. sweep. Nicely done. Makes him pay with a counter. That's a tag. tag is made. What's going to happen here? Boom off the boot. Stop in the leg. Here we go. Jimmy going up high. Uh oh. Oh my God, what a move. Targets the gut to end the offense. Tag made here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, Cena wasn't ready. Could be over. Makes a cover. He kicked out. Oh, my God, he kicked out. Incredible resiliency. Down to Odin. And a double axe handle smash. Handle. Using the elbow to escape the attack. Each competitor showing it on their own. Solo Sokoa signaling to the audience, and they are responding. Able to get there in time. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. No. Oh, just completely off target there. Really thought that was going to work, but now we got a human being we have to scrape off the floor. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Oh, vicious headbutt. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh! Delivering nasty stops. Oh, fought back with an elbow right to the jaw. Kicking out in time. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. He gets tagged in. Uh-oh. Ooh, rake of the face. That is agonizing. Come on. There's no fair play. 
claim that. Close fist connects. There it is. Boom. Nice. Up the turnbuckles. What's he going to do? From the top. Samoan splash from Solo. Is it enough? The cover. Waist lock. No, no. Belly to belly. My goodness. Just mounted with punches and not and a Oof. stop to the gut too. Who's here? Ah, oh, some taunting going on. Future matchup, perhaps? I'd say that's a highly likely possibility. Make way for the It Couple. 
The following contest is scheduled for one thumb. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Maurice from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. Miz and Maurice are one of the most dominant pairs the entertainment world has ever seen. In the ring, on TV, on the red carpet, they are always a force to be reckoned with. They certainly do know how to keep themselves in front of the camera and soak up the spotlight. No denying that, Maurice and The Miz have made themselves inescapable. We are graced by the presence of two all-time great competitors. They inspire each other to be better. I'm inspired because they are their best when they are at each other's side. It also makes the cheating a little easier. Oh, this is my favorite part. He's gonna sing. Y'all know what time it is. This is the part where we crank it up. Let's crank it up. Now here we go. People over there, what's up? You feel me? Stand up and say what's up. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? You can get with this or you can get with that. You better get with this. Cause this is where it's at. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? See, I be skipping and jumping, leaving the competition. I make him disappear like your favorite magician. And I ride it till the wheel fall off. I bounce back to back till they next get soft. Most of the time you see me, I'm being simple. Then many times I be busting them up like a pimple. Stating my claim to fame. To be one of the baddest young brothers step foot in this game. And I haven't even started yet. You can better believe I take it off the show shot bet. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? WWE's resident A-list celebrity, The Miz, looking to make a star shine even brighter tonight. Miz is one of the WWE's biggest stars ever, and there's no question why. He's one of the most dedicated athletes we've ever seen here. Whether you agree with his tactics or not, you can't deny his desire to win. We'll see if those tactics come to fruition once again in this match. But let's not forget our truth is a well-seasoned veteran with a laundry list of title reigns attached to his name. This is a competitor who knows what's up. I can't disagree. R-Truth's proven he has what it takes to be an enduring mainstay on the WWE roster. Truth's a gifted superstar, and that laundry list says 24-7 more times than Saxton can count. Stop puller leg snap! Oh, snap your hamstring. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Truth caught by surprise. Measured stomp right to the gut. Followed up by another to the chest. into the ring. And wait a minute, what's the manager doing under the apron? This is why it's good to have a manager. It's good to have an ally who wants you to win as badly as you do and will introduce any tool to produce victory. Miz telegraphing that one right to the kidneys from behind. Side headlock applied. What a good measure. Tearing down the, he's got him down. Is this it? Powers through after two. And frustration might be starting to set in. Oh, Matt slam with some attitude. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. There's no denying the awesome in-ring abilities of The Miz. He avoids the damage. Screw calf kick. Whoa! Ah, oh, straight to the floor. I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. Just a continuous rush on our truth here. This is the mindset you have to be in against our truth. Never underestimate him, not even for a second. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. DDT! Planet. Kick lands. Oh, right 
in the kidneys. Golly. Shot after shot, they're slamming their face down. Look out! Oh, God! That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. And he gets set back into the ring. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. No, oh, right to the throat. That could be it. Oh, truth. What a kick out. He clearly has no intention of staying down. Oh, the reversal by R Truth. taking a gigantic gamble Whoa. like that. And now gets tossed into the ring. Yeah. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Punishing the leg. Clearly had a strategy going on there with the attention on the leg. Miz escapes damage. Neckbreaker! Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be good! Oh, man! And he's able to counter. He skirts around it. The Miz has it hooked. Oh, Skull crushing finale. Miz can taste it now. The Miz is going to be gloating about this for a long time. As well he should, Saxton. I can't wait to hear more about this win at the A-Listers after party. Here come the Steiner Brothers. From collegiate wrestling standouts to the WWE Hall of Fame. The following contest is a triple threat tag team match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 531 pounds, Rick and Scott, the Steiner Brothers. 
Plenty of raw power between those two men. They're both the powerhouse of this team. It's because they're in the gym when they're not in the ring. And when they hit the weights, the weights feel it. Los Lotharios are here. Here to chase after glory and women. And at a combined weight of 403 pounds, Angel Garza and Alberto Los Lotharios. The Latin lovers, Los Lotharios, now trying to prove they can be lovers and fighters. A pair of high-flying heartbreakers. Now they know how to get it done in the ring and save the partying for later. And they're hoping to have a lot to celebrate tonight. Los Lotharios are hoping for a quick win here so they can hurry back to all their adoring fans. Oh, don't hold your breath, ladies. This looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. Multiple teams facing off in this Tornado Tag Match. In a Tornado Tag situation, you never know how many opponents will be targeting you. The only one on your side is your tag team partner. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's going to hurt. Cranking the head. Got the full Nelson. Slam. There was no issue with that attack. Times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? You want to control the tempo, you want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. What kind of headspace do you need to be successful in a no disqualification match? A ruthless one, Cole. You can't show any remorse about going after your opponent full force. Anytime you waste second guessing yourself, it's time for your opponent to get their hands on a weapon. He's getting a little battered now. Steiner attacked like a corner dog there. This lock using the ropes. Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. Fishing for something beneath the ring. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. Boom, right across the small of the back. some lasting damage to the body. Acrobatics. 
moves like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Oh, a
Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Elbow drop. Pearson. superstars that go great together and that win is proof love them or hate them you know they did everything they could to earn this win
the original, the official, the only club that matters. More championships among the three than most of the locker room combined. OC loves to have a good time, but the one thing they might love even more is getting into a good old-fashioned fight. Yeah, they brawled all over the world and sometimes with each other. The OC never sleeps on a good fight. The OC looking ready to get to work. Get to work in that ring and then get into a few cold ones after all said and done. That is the OC way. Guys, shut up. I got this. It's fight night! And their opponents, accompanied by Sheamus, at a combined weight of 458 pounds, Ridge Holland. Holland, Sheamus, Butch, three men bonded by their love for fighting. Yeah, you could say that again, Cole. These three will fight anyone in the locker room, anyone in the street. Heck, they'll fight each other if they have to. Hey, no matter who fights who, there's one guarantee. It'll be fun to watch. The brawling brutes are about to show us all how they earned that name. Ladies and gentlemen, fight night is officially underway. The brawling brutes ready and raring to go in this one. You just won't find a more physical, more smash mouth team in WWE than the brutes. Like you always say, Michael, it's always fight night when the brutes are around. Whether it's themselves or the competition, someone's coming out of this match bruised and broken. And that's just how the brutes like it. And the OC's ready to get down and dirty if they have to. This is a team who knows how to win, who knows how to beat up the competition, who knows how to celebrate when it's all said and done. A collective unit. There are no egos within the OC. Tagged into the action. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Any offense from Carr. Oh, Boom, hit the button. Oh, my goodness. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Into a power slam. Talk about intimidation. I'm not sure if it's resilience or stupidity that's going to drive you to try and come back from a move like that. In the corner. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. Oh my god. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. And the knee. Call a step ahead. Inflicted. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. What a punch. Elbow on the 
spot. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. He's absorbed some damage already. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Into the corner. This can't be good. Here he comes off the tag. is going to be hard for oh my gosh what impact and knees to the back gets the tag he made it tag made Leave a mark. Caught with a DDT. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. And Gallows just unleashed that brawling offense there. Big right hand. Thunderous power slam. Impeccable display of power. I have no clue how that was pulled off. Talk about dismantling your opponent. And off the tag is Carl Anderson. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Carefully measured knee drop. Just hot shot it to the outside. Suplex. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Whoa. Oh. And he slides him back to the mat. And did you hear the impact of that? On to the back of the neck. He's absorbing some tough hits now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Collins was the any command of this match. Carl has everything going how he wants it. Got the tag. Got the tag. Powerless position to be in right now. Straight impact on the throat. Position for both superstars. Oh gosh. Nasty. The hardest part of the ring. Down to Bonus. And a double axe handle smash. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. 
I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Butch. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. Wiggles free. From behind. Chop block. He needs to fight his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Will Gallows clearly wants a fight here. The Kimura, the Kimura. Kimura lock up. He doesn't have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. Uh-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. Butch has set his sights on his opponent now. He has a task at hand, but prefers to be showboating right now. Fresh man in. Oh, Anderson muscles up. Uh-oh. Can't quite get him there. Oh, and a stomp right to the back of the neck. And Anderson fends him off. They're slamming their face down. And now the blood is starting to flow from the face of Butch. Tags him in. DDT! Vicious, downright savage club right there. Butch at a disadvantage. With a good brother slam. Butch won't come back after that. It's a big hit. He is mentally and physically exhausted now. This is a very dangerous situation now. This deep into a match is where trouble rises, where injuries may occur. You got it. Nice takedown. Could be looking for the triangle. Got to pass the arm. He needs to break this submission, and the left hands will do it. Tag made, tag made. Ooh, Luke imposing a flurry of offense. Perhaps Ridge needs to go back to the drawing board. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Gut wrench and hoisting up their opponent. Face first into a DDT. Holland might just have it. He keeps his team in the match. Ripped in the hard way. Reversal. Can he take advantage? An agile escape. Front face lock applied into an airplane spin. Look at this power. Oh, and an elbow caught him and cleared him to the floor. And gets tossed back into the mat. Throws the opposition back into the ring. <laughs> Unloads with the boot. We might be close to the end. Maybe just stay down, man. You've done enough. Uh-oh. Does he have it here? They kick out at only one. How this match is still going on defies all reasoning. Ranked around. Breaker. This has been an epic encounter. These fans are sending the decibel level off the scale. Punishing their opponent. Clubbing blows for the win. Loads off the pin at two. Almost inhuman at this point.
these debilitating forearm strikes. Brutality. And it looks like that opened Gallows right up. Look at this strength. Incredible power slam. He catches Gallows with a big counter. Tagged into action. Counters right into the swift chop block. Once more, setting it up. Will Gallows with the Good Brother Slam. Will Gallows end it here? Oh, what a save. Corey, that should have been three. I couldn't agree more. Caught with that sharp elbow. Big boot. He can end it here. He's got Such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here are your winners, Ridge Holland and Butch, the Brawling Brutes. A rowdy and raucous win for the Brawling Brutes tonight. You got to think the Brutes are buying around at the pub after this sort of win. Here comes Indy Hartwell, one of the toughest underdogs in the women's division. Women's Championship. Truly battle tested. She's ready to continue that success on the main roster. Would you say, Cole, that she's impressive? Welcome. The Empress of Tomorrow. Asuka is in her own world, and she is ready to get down to impose her will. And her opponents, first from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! She is mysterious. She is hypnotic. She is lethal. She is... Asuka, and there is no one else like her.
Asuka absolutely unfazed. She just knows how dangerous she is. She is not someone to ever take lightly, and she plans to prove that again tonight. Here comes the heart of Chase U. And representing Chase University from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the Hale. One of the most impressive and maybe a bit overzealous students to come out of Chase University. But Thea Hale is dead set on proving that she is a grown woman who can get things done on her own. Thea Hale is ready to step up to any challenge. Hale set to change the minds of all the doubters and naysayers tonight. Three of WWE's top competitors ready for this triple threat match. Set for action with Mindy Hartwell, Asuka, and Thea Hale. Always a feeling out process in the early goings of a triple threat. You want to gauge your distance. You want to know just how much real estate you can have to yourself. You don't want to be the first one targeted because things can snowball against you quickly. Counter from Asuka. Snapmare. There's a kick. Tossed into the corner. Oh, the elbow connects. Caught with the boot. This competitor grabbing hold of their opponent's arm. Delivering a clothesline, but look at this. Holding on for more. A second clothesline. And you can only imagine that the trio boom, is in effect. Using the elbow as a weapon. Stiff elbow will break that up. Big boot. <laughs> Did you hear that impact? German suplex. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Look, I know it may sound cliche, but with triple threat matches, you've always got to keep your head on a swivel. Always got to know when to pick your spot, even if you form an alliance. It won't last. That's just the nature of the game. And Thea Hale gets contested there. This is just spectacular offense from Indy Hartwell right now. What? This is turning into Swanson Street. Uh, using a handful of hair to deliver the snapmare. And this is even worse, my goodness. Delivering the suplex. Yokes up their opponent. Driven down with a sidewalk slam. Enable to counter. Push your perfect takedown. Right on target with a stop to the gut. Some mental chess here from Thea Hale. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. He's a side of the Clearly an attack that very few superstars can perform. Well, That's one of my all-time favorites. Showing off their submission. Oh, this is unique. Oh, man, what a counter. Great escape. Assistance punishing their opponent. Pulverizing the arm is a great way to create an advantage. Basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. Neck breaker. Shoulder tackle. 
pinnacle. She bails in a hurry. Hartwell looking to make an example of her above cover. Shoulders are down. Pushes through after two. If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. Oh, straight forearm. She's ready to do some serious damage courtesy of that steel chair. And that toss got some hang time. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just got to toss another person to make a statement. Right to the kidneys from behind. Oh, that didn't go as Asuka designed. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. She had it scouted. Snapmare takedown. Oh, a roundhouse kick. Big right hand. going through the arena. And the pace of things really catching up to Indy Hartwell there. Hanging tough as this match progresses. No easy task in a triple threat match. Oh, of course, for a neck breaker. She could do it here. The pin's broken up. I can't believe it. Oh, that clothesline hurt. Holding on for more. And a second. I say the third time's the charm. Will that be the case? Control. Dangerous intentions in her mind right now. Shades of the OEC dub as a candlestick is introduced to the proceedings. <laughs> Scratching and clawing. This could be it. Running interference. She anticipated that one. DDT! Oh. Looking for the victory! Two! Breaks the count. She just won't stay down. Oh, what a 
Side drop kick. On the mark. <laughs> ah, look at this. Golly, that could do permanent damage. God, disturbing impact. She's going for it. This could be. What a performance and what a win. Here is your winner, Asuka. What a performance. Huge win here in this triple threat match. To win a triple threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner... Shut up, Saxton. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring, accompanied by Big E at a combined weight of 417 pounds. Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston, the New Day! What makes the New Day so impressive is the incredible bond these superstars share. Seems like nothing will ever come between them. They celebrate each other's successes and are by each other's sides in loss. Now you really can't help but be inspired by these guys. They've accomplished so many incredible things together. It's true. Historic championship reigns, memorable matches, the power of positivity has taken the New Day far. Here comes Gallus. A group of true Scottish hooligans. And their opponents, accompanied by Wolfgang, at a combined weight of 486 pounds, Mark Coffey and Joe Coffey Gallus. Stepping out of the pub tonight to take care of business. I'm sure they're in a rush to get back there, too. There is no safe quarter when Gallus is in action. Everyone is a target.
There's the bell, and Gallus looks ready to unleash their brand of bold and daring offense. Yeah, and at times, they are downright brass, Michael. There are no pleasantries about the way they attack their opponents, no matter who the unfortunate team is to meet them in the ring. I wouldn't want to meet them in the pub either, Byron. Well, they'll have to deal with a little unicorn magic in the form of your boys, the New Day. No, oh, apart from those times they threw pancakes in my face, this is probably the best tag team WWE's ever had. The perfect combination of speed, power, and intelligence. These guys have a license to print money and a free lease in their opponents' heads. Oh, close line. When you see a unit as aligned as they are, it's really incredible. Dangerous position here, guys. Oh, no, 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 back no. Back suplex, a back suplex right onto the apron. You don't aim for the apron unless you're looking to do some serious damage. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Wood solo talents couldn't do much to help him against that attack. And the manager is searching under the ring. He could only be looking for something nefarious down there. And that was some brutal impact on that DDT. Nice. That'll either wake you up or knock you out. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm sorry, kick. Followed up by another to the chest. Can he score the pin? He gets the shoulder up at two. This could be a tipping point in this match. the tag. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Boom. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, sit out slam. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. Get his press. Practically never ending blows coming at full force here. He's got the answer for that one. when you're able to pull off that move. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Beat the count back in. This one will continue. Oh, man. What a strike. Cover. Shoulders are down. And still hanging on. He really thought that was it. Sure seems to be getting out of there in a hurry. A chance to get his thoughts together and regroup. From behind, back suplex. He's lost some of his win now. The power of positivity paying dividends for the New Day. Emphasis on power. Look out! The it's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Toss back into the ring. Oh, man. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down and... Goodness gracious. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Ah, striking with an A. Right to the back of the neck. Xavier Woods falling victim to an onrush now. Piece by piece, Joe is chipping away.
And Xavier Woods reverses. Oh, I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Oh, right on the arm. Not good. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He catches Woods with a counter. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Uh-oh. Harlem sidekick. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Xavier Woods is picking the competition apart. Joe's got to slow down this assault. Partner tags in. Set up in the corner of the ring. Bulldog. Cover here. Fights at it, too. How in the world did he kick out? Rolling neck snap. Brutal. hesitation and that risk gained big rewards and now thrown back into the ring he may get the three count right here this is it The New Day prevailing here tonight with the victory. This right pairing can certainly do wonders, and make no mistake, this was a wonderful performance tonight.
spent a decade atop WWE with the accolades to prove it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa. is an architect, a visionary, and a revolutionary who adapts to challenges like a chameleon. Seth Rollins will do whatever it takes, find any strategy to further his greatness. Here comes main event, Jey Uso. And his opponent from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds. Jey Uso in something of a new position on his own. Some trepidation, but also some freedom. Well, as much as he gained from the bloodline and his brother, becoming the main event is something Jey needs to do on his own. And Jey is more than equipped to do it. We know Seth Rollins is a master of mind games, so if you're this superstar, whatever it takes, whatever you have to do, keep Rollins out of your head. And I've cut Corey's mic so I can just calmly say that we'll start things off with Seth freaking Rollins. With his combination of creativity, athleticism, and skill, Rollins considers himself the guiding light of WWE, a beacon for the company, an example of what a WWE superstar should be. And the crazy thing is, he's kind of right. Honestly, minus the attitude and whatever fawning Graves wishes he could get out right now, I find it difficult. Uh, it's it's fine. It cinched it. We're gonna free the arm and does just that. for Jay. Oh, I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Corey, plain and simple here. What's Rollins got to do to get the win tonight? Plain and simple? Just be Seth freaking Rollins, Cole. But nothing about Rollins has ever been plain and simple. We've seen the lengths he can go, the machinations he's willing to enact. To... If this lands, it's over. Good oh. Lord. Taking flight. Big time risk. He's off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Hoisted up, double underhook. Weaves out into a close line. Oh, he retaliates. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. This is why Jey Uso deserves his place in the spotlight. That's an attack worthy of being the main event. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Kick to the gut. Right the round into a neck breaker. How's that for a counter? Hoist it up. Oh, right to the gut. Oh, he's 
He's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Setting up neck breaker position. Bang! Rollins lining it up. Rollins with the stomp. Jay is down and out. Takes the cover. Uh, time to enjoy the win. A familiar face here joining in on the celebration. This has got to feel good. Not only do you win the match, you got your friend there to celebrate with you. The man has arrived. And the WWE Universe is on their feet. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. A main eventer, a former double champion, left WWE to have a child and returned without losing a step. Well, that's just the man doing the man things. Became the first women's double champion when she beat Charlotte Flair at WrestleMania. Yeah, but every once in a while, that much confidence can be detrimental, especially when you're a target. Everyone wants to make a name off of the man. Ladies and gentlemen, mommy's home. Here comes Rhea Ripley. And representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia, the WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley may just be one of the most intimidating presences WWE has ever experienced in either division. She strikes pure, unbridled fear straight into the hearts of her opposition. Yeah, it's almost impossible not to second-guess yourself when you're taking on Rhea Ripley. She can just seem unstoppable at times. I think Ripley has done all she can to cultivate the aura of fear. There's a mental aspect to her game that you can't overlook.
Well, one thing is you have to answer Becky's amazing in-ring IQ and willingness to do anything to win. Well, if she can find the right strategy, it'll change her career. Some call her the last kicker. Some call her the man. But all you really need to know about Becky Lynch is that she brings the fight every time she steps in the ring. Becky is fired up, and so is the WWE Universe. Few superstars draw off the crowd's energy like Lynch does. They fan the flames of her all-consuming drive to win and push her to go beyond her own limits. The deafening roar of the WWE fans and Becky Lynch kind of go hand in hand at this point. We'll see if she can deliver for the crowd in this one. And facing off against her is the Eradicator, Rhea Ripley. A woman who declares that there can only be one ruler in the women's division. And you're looking at her. Rhea Ripley demands the entire women's division calls her mommy and declares the time for complete eradication has arrived. If you ask me, I think Rhea will continue to get her way here tonight. And that was a heck of a heave we just saw. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Well, face first. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Up for the electric chair. Down. Can she score the pin? In a kick out. This isn't even close to over. Becky moves out of the way. Becky Lynch with a great shot. Oh. Oh, flying forearm, that'll turn your lights out. And no remorse is shown towards Ripley as she absorbed that attack. Some dominant offense there from the one and only man. If you're taking on Becky Lynch, here's a piece of advice. Don't take your eyes off her. Becky has a talent for coming out of nowhere with big, impactful attacks. So pin her down with direct offense and don't let up. Yeah, just how many times have we seen Becky dig deep and turn the tables at the last minute? Lynch looking to secure. Locked in. This will break your arm in a hurry. Can Becky's opponent hang on? And she releases the hold as she feels that enough damage has been done. Should have kept on wrenching. Why show mercy now? Knew what was coming there. Rhea isn't taking this lying down anymore. But she still has to do more to get this fully in her favor. A flat-out power into the scoop slam. Enough already. A little psychological warfare at play here from the Nightmare. Boom! Ripley with an opening to go high. From the top. Whoa, what a landing! And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Endless knee strikes. There's return fire on Rhea. Ow! Knee to the cheekbone. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. This is just brute power. What a German suplex! Lynch is losing command in this one. I like what I see. Pinning Lynch down with offense so she can't find an opportunity to turn the tables. Face first off the knee. God driven face first. That's good. Oh, believe me, this superstar realizes how... Oh, oh, come on! A second. I understand being frustrated, but that's ridiculous. This superstar just crossed the line.
Make way for the ring general, Gunther. Six foot five, nearly 300 pounds of pure malice. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria. Weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Gunther! there's all business. There is very little wasted motion in this man when he gets going. Well, there may be roadblocks in his path, but Gunther's dominance has shown no signs of slowing. Record-breaking reigns with the NXT UK and Intercontinental titles. He's put away main eventers and future Hall of Famers while defending those titles. A multi-platinum, multi-award winning recording artist, Bad Bunny. Yeah, he's a heck of a competitor inside the ring and as well. his opponent from Vega Baja, Puerto Rico, weighing in at 160 pounds. He is the most screamed artist in the world, Bad Bunny! The feeling in here is electric. Bad Bunny has the crowd going wild. And Bunny instantly forged a bond with the WWE Universe. Now they fuel him to do incredible things inside the ring. We'll have to contend with Gunther's devastating, unforgiving, punishing chops. All right, here we go. This is a no disqualification match. Anything goes from here on out. Weapons, outside interference, use of excessive force, it's all in play. And to everyone watching at home, I can assure you, medical teams are standing by. Gunther shifts that to his favor. Counter upon counter, great minds thinking alike. Yikes. Avoiding contact. Paint a picture for me, Corey. And look at this now, bad intentions coming with this hole. They're gonna find an escape from the abdominal stretch. Uh-oh, found it. Knee drop. Ooh. Sharp knee. Looks like Bad Bunny got busted up on that one. Knife edge chop. And even as Bad Bunny gets battered here, you can tell he has no intention of backing down. That shows you the ring general's genius in action. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Being carried around with ease. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. What's coming next? Back suplex. Very nice. And he goes for the pin. And a kick out. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Oh, my God, what impact. Bad Bunny is being cut down at every corner. Gunther's doing whatever he wants, because he can. Bad Bunny evades the attack. Loving blow. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. This feud is starting to become one of those that will go down in history. Clashes like this are what puts names in the Hall of Fame, Cole. I'm just glad we get to watch it firsthand. He was elusive there. Oof, nails the midsection. Each shot landing with a little bit more venom. Looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Looks like a hockey fight's just broken up. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. WWE Universe appreciating these athletes going all out. And Bad Bunny caught by surprise. Both absolutely. 
absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. Exhaustion set it in, and neither one of them is letting up. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Run! He's got his head down still. Paying it right back with a reversal. Ooh, a vicious shot right to the dome. Able to avoid there. Gunther, just a force of nature to contend with. This could do it. Oh, he kicked out. Somehow, some way. Bad Bunny setting up something big. What the heck? Bunny Destroyer? That's it. Gunther is out. For the win. Two count. That's it. The blood and sweat put into this match. Well worth it. Here is your winner. He is the most screamed artist in the world, Bad Bunny. This is a war Gunther just could not win. From conquering the charts to conquering the squared circle, Bad Bunny is living the dream.